AD, but by the time you got the ball in that final play, you had hit, I think, four second half threes and found a nice rhythm out there. We're just wondering what the discussion was in the timeout and, and how that play developed as uh, you saw LeBron drive and if you, you know, thought you were going to get it. Yeah, uh, it was a play for him. Just kind of get downhill like he got last possession. Uh, and DeAndre helped. You know, he made, made a great pass, just missed a shot. Even though you missed the shot, uh, going through late game opportunities with with LeBron and seeing combinations that you guys can work with together, how can that be helpful as we move down these last 19 games? Yeah, I mean, a lot of the shots going to be open. We're going to, you know, everybody else going to get a lot of open shots. Um, his ability to to get in the paint and draw a defense just like he did, he had three guys on him. Um, and it's our job to, to, you know, finish plays. Um, so moving forward, obviously, you know, knowing that he's – he draws a lot of attention. Um, we got to be shot ready. Uh, AD, uh, you guys haven't played as many small lineups as you did tonight, partly because Dwight was out. What did you like? What did you think maybe you guys can do better in some of those smaller lineups? Uh, I like what we did defensively. Uh, you know, they didn't shoot the ball extremely well, but you know, we gave up a lot of offensive rebounds. Um, you know, one thing when we're when we're playing small ball. Uh, you know, and we're able to switch, um, you know, or veer back to her, to their bigs. You know, it put them to the, put them in the advantage. You know, DeAndre and uh, Jared Allen got a couple offensive rebounds um, and kicked it off with some big time shots. So um, that's the only thing you know that we kind of give up is the ability to rebound the ball. But other than that, I like the way we play. Anthony, it seemed like. Um you guys fed off the crowd in the last minute, obviously chance, defense chance and, and things like that. Um, obviously, you don't know if it's going to happen, but can you imagine what it would be like if that was just not part of the game, if you didn't have the 18,000 fans there and and try to, I don't know, replicate that energy? Um, I mean, you can't. It's, it's nothing like the fans. Uh, like you said, we, we kind of fed off the energy late in the game. Um, so don't tell them, you know, if they didn't want to allow to come to this game, they'll, you know, tell them what the score will be or how we'll play, but um, if it happens, it happens. Nothing we can do about it. We got to continue to go out there and, and play ball games, but um, you know, hopefully, you know, we're able to get through it. Um, Anthony, how much have you had conversations with your teammates about just this health crisis that's going on? Are you, you know, trying to research stuff yourself? Are you buying anything to combat it? Is it just curious if it's affected your life even incrementally? Um, team doctor come in and, and, and he talked to us about everything. Uh, you know, just you know, keeping ourselves clean, washing our hands, and you know how, how much to wash our hands, you know, twenty seconds and stuff like that. But just really gave us an update about uh, the virus and you know where it was, um, and, and in relation to LA uh, and the potential of not playing in front of fans. Um, that's really it. Um, you know, for me, it's just, you know, like the league, you know, sending out the memo, you know, giving pounds instead of high fives and stuff like that. So uh, just kind of be wary of all that. And, uh, you know, everybody was playing and, and goofing around, calling us the Corona boys because I licked my hand, but I didn't. So put that out there. I never licked my fingers. I thought about that actually before I, before I did it. But, um, you know, we we just trying to, you know, one thing you can do is kind of, you know, stay sanitized. Last two questions. Can you, in, in the big picture, what has this season been like just with all this this group has been through? I mean, you go back to basically the very beginning of the season in China. You didn't know if you were going to be playing those games over there. Just your first year in L.A. What has this been like? No, it's been fun. Uh, there's been a lot of obstacles that we've been through, uh, you know, starting with the preseason. Um and we've been we we've, we've gone through it, you know. Uh, it's it's been, you know, a great experience for me um, thus far, and you know I, I think we're you know right where we want to be, and you know the team is constantly improving and getting better. So um, this first you know year for me has been, been nothing but amazing. Um, I I just want to make sure I didn't misunderstand the the when you licked your hand but you didn't lick your hand that was last game. Mm -hmm. Are you talking about? And you high-fived Avery. Yeah. Like you thought about it before you 
We're about to do it. Yeah, it was just, I mean, <laughs> it was just disgusting. So I did. <laughs> I actually thought about it, and I was like, don't do it. And so I kind of just like mimicked it, and it was like this whole little thing. But I'm cleaner than that, so. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For more sports highlights and analysis, be sure to download the ESPN app. And for live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.